One big explosion is all that I heard and felt and experienced. The passenger who filmed these images described the moment of the explosion. We felt uh, a small blast of air and uh, we heard some thudding in the distance. Uh, the, the metro immediately stopped, uh, the lights turned off, the engine turned off, and a message came over the intercom saying uh, that there had been a disturbance on the line. One big explosion is all that I heard and felt and experienced. Um, so I wanted to share that with you and it's going to happen in Brussels city. There was uh, an explosion at the Malbec railway station, the metro station, in the center of Brussels. I just felt, at the beginning before the explosion, I just felt an anxious type of feeling like something's going to happen, something's going to happen, and then, like, big explosion. Moments later, an explosion at the Malbec subway station, close to the headquarters of the European Union. Panic when commuters heard a loud boom as the train left the station. Billowing smoke and terror, an indicator of the ambush deep below ground. The single blast in a central carriage took the deaths into double figures. And um, I knew that I was in Belgium, in my country, and in Brussels, specifically Brussels. It wasn't in like a different city in Ghent or whatever. I felt that I was in Brussels. Ten after nine, and deep underground, a massacre in the Brussels metro. A bomb has just exploded. <coughs> Dozens flee through the darkness. It's terrifying. Uh, what did I see? I did see some people trying to figure out what's going on, what's going on, what happened and all that. I was getting off the metro station in Arnois when we heard a loud muffled thud. Some panic kind of set in, some people started to, to rush out of the metro station very quickly and we were met by soldiers. So yeah, I wanted to share that with you. I know in the news they're saying that there's no threat or don't worry, don't panic, but what I saw is what I saw and I've decided to share it.